Good morning. Damn, it's hot today. I see it's, I don't know, almost three o'clock in the day. Sorry, almost three o'clock. The day is actually getting hotter as the sun descends. Where's the logic in that? <sighs> the roosters are screaming as usual. And I'm going to make them finally stop. Can't fucking take it anymore. So today is the day. The roosters go silent forever. I need sleep. The roosters will not let me sleep. So, the final solution. Today is the day. Speaking of final solutions, this is the second to the last video that I plan on making about the Forest Fen treasure hunt. I noticed east of here, I don't know, two miles, three miles, whatever the hell, it's like Woodstock out there from treasure hunters getting the jump on each other for the weekend to see if they can find the fabulous, fabulous wealth, what people consider wealth, before everybody else. It's like Woodstock only without all of the marijuana. Where the hell was I? Yeah, I see in the news, actually on the Facebook um, Forest Fen Thrill of the Chase uh, web page, somebody out there is hunting for the treasure in Albuquerque. Albuquerque! Not where Forest Fen said he hid the treasure, but in fucking Albuquerque! Lady! Get one of these! North! He said, North of Santa Fe, New Mexico! In the mountains thereof! Fucking North! You know where Albuquerque is in relation to Santa Fe? If you had one of these, you would know! Just same. <sighs> Meanwhile, I attended a um, presentation, actually it was a talk between three writers at Collected Works, Collected Works Bookstore in Santa Fe, I guess, be um, two years ago this September, where Mr. Forrest Fenn talked about his memoir and, of course, the treasure that he has hidden somewhere in the mountains north of Santa Fe, not Albuquerque. And I didn't, uh, couldn't afford the book at the time, so it was a year, I guess, in uh, last September, I guess, that I went and bought the book finally at Collected Works Bookstore, read the memoir. And by the way, it is an awesome life, well worth living. I recommend reading the book, even if you're not hunting for his hidden treasure chest. I also read the poem wherein the major clues for how to find that hidden treasure chest are um, given. And at the time I thought, it's fucking obvious where the hell the hiding place for this chest is. The poem is, um, from what I can tell, it is broken up into three places, or three groups. The first group states where to look. The second group states how to get to the hiding spot. And the third group states what to look for. And back then, last September, it appeared fucking obvious to me where the hell to look. And going through the uh, memoir and the poem um, this past week or so, 
it is still what I consider obvious where it is hidden. However, I see that on several websites out there on the internet, a hell of a lot of people also think the solution is obvious. And they have gone looking, and they haven't found it. So, logic dictates that I am A, that, that's a letter A, that is not a number one. I am wrong, or B, I am so clever that what is not at all obvious to a genius like me is. And I have this sneak, sneaky suspicion, it's number A, I mean letter A. I have no idea where this finger has been. Where was I? So, since nobody has, apparently nobody has found it, it must not really be as obvious as I thought it was. Therefore, I am not the wilderness hermit equivalent of Nero Wolf. And that what I consider to be bloody obvious is obviously bloody obviously not bloody obvious. If you understand that thinking. I am going to make a private video that I'm not going to tell anybody about. I'm not going to say what channel it will be on. I'm not going to say what the URL for that video is. And I'm going to state in that video my solution to the clues in Forrest Fenn's memoir. I'm going to state the time and the date. <sighs> Five minutes after three, May 17th, 2013, I'm going to make that video. I'm going to state where I think the hidden treasure is. Someday, and I hope it is soon, before this coming up winter, I'm going to actually go look where I think the hidden treasure chest is. If I find it, let her see. Fuck, that hurts. Letter C, that's right, C. If I happen to find the treasure chest, I'm going to play with it for a while because I've never had a golden jewel encrusted cram packed treasure chest to play with before. And after I play with it for a while, I'm going to take some images, I'm going to take a token out of it and leave the rest because I don't need a treasure chest. What the fuck would I do with a treasure chest? Anyhow, that is the plan. The reason I want to make that video is in case I cannot go there this year and collect it, I want a record showing what I thought was bloody obvious. If somebody finds it in the same place that I think it is, I can point to that video and say, Look at the time and date. I was right. Enjoy the treasure chest. I don't need it. Uh, I could afford uh, medical care if I did find it and kept it. But I was clever enough to figure out where that bloody hell it is. <sighs> or I could just take the chest and sell it at auction with Christie's. Meanwhile, the Roosters have a date with Fortune.